Welcome, welcome to the Scam Cast. We got another one for you, hosted by yours truly, Scam Sweet. God. <laughs> Sweet. And we got here your co host, Daddy Ratchet, aka Baby Goat. Let's get it. And we yeah. starting off with the throwback of the week from now on. Because, nigga, we is them new niggas. Hey, <laughs> and hey, just know that hey, shit. Hey. Yeah. Throwback of the throwback. week, nigga. If you don't know about this, you a motherfucking lame, and All that's on God, nigga. Talk that shit. We're gonna let it rock just a little bit for y'all. Hey. Woo! Hey. Shout out Mob Deep, man. Shout him out, man. Prodigy. R.I.P. R.I.P. You are a ghost. Big fat. Niggas was like 19 when they did this CD, too, like. You already know, man. All right, so yeah, we don't want to get flagged. We don't want to get flagged, y'all. Sad. Yeah. So yeah, we don't own the copyrights yeah. of that music. It's, <laughs> we definitely don't. We definitely don't. But we gotta show love to that to that player shit like that. Shout out. We gotta show that love. That's it. <laughs> but yeah, so yeah, man, what's good with you, man? We got the Super Bowl. What's happening, baby? Go, man. Who you go? Oh, baby. Man, I'm going for the motherfucking forty Come nine. On, man, the forty nine is they let Cap go, bro. What the fuck does that have to do with right now? <laughs> <laughs> Niggas. That's, why, that's why I don't rock with him, bro. Oh, my nigga Cap still ain't got a job because of the 49 And look, this is what happens. Sometimes niggas got to get sacrificed. <laughs> no, they look. That's why they got to win. The niggas <laughs> sacrifice Cap. They said, look, you get rid of him. He was a sacrificial lamb, bro. <laughs> that's fucked Yo, up, bro. <laughs> that, hey, I never looked at it that way until, like, on oh, God, shit. bro. Like, that nigga say sacrifice my nigga. So Definitely, Richard Sherman is definitely ready. <laughs> Russell Wilson from from the R, even though he's not with them. Facts. We just gotta shout him out because he the man. Shout out. But long story short, Richard Sherman ain't having that shit. Yeah, you man. know, offense is ready. I got thirty five twenty seven. Mm. San Fran. What you thinking, my dog? Other way around. Mm, so that's mm. the that score sound right that's though. That, that score sound perfect. Okay, yes. Yeah, so it's gonna be it's gonna be a good game. Yeah, they gonna put up some points. That's why I'm Facts. like, yo, 27-35 sound right. That's a good ass. That was they, good. That's yeah, good. yeah. So if, if the 49ers do this and this happen, I think I should get a check off that. No, but check. You know, swipe. <laughs> look. So look, we um we're gonna shout my nigga Tim out too, Tim Harris. You know, he played shout with out. the 49ers. You know, I know he from the R as well. Hey. Um, I know that gotta be a wonderful feeling to be not just at the Super Bowl, nigga. You 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 get to fucking participate Facts. in the fucking event. Facts. You know what I'm saying? So you know, we're going to also talk about um Kobe, man. Because when we found oh, out last week, let's pull up, man. We got to pull up. Anytime, R.I.P. Kobe, anytime we mention him, we got to pull up. Kobe is the motherfucking, he's the Kobe. You know what I'm saying? He's you the know, Kobe, nigga. You feel me? Like, yeah. fuck it. You know how niggas be like, yeah, now Bron is like magic. You feel me? And all that. No, nah, Bron is Bron. Facts. <laughs> Kobe is Kobe. Yeah. And Mike is Mike. It's three goats in three different generations, bro. It is. And it's like, I believe, like, Kobe, for real, he the one. Just because he just, he won't have in it. Yeah. You feel me? Like, the mumble mentality is some, some next rest level peace, shit. Rest in peace, Kobe, man. Rest in peace, GG. So, we got, yeah, rest in peace. So, they're saying that he died holding his daughter. And I could believe it. I do, too. I could believe it, He bro. a girl dad, bro. So, yeah, that's probably was just first reaction only instinct he, he thought of was trying to protect her speaking of girl dads we have to go into the javante thing as well but we're going to stay on <laughs> we're going to stay on kobe for a little minute man yeah. because like that shit is real serious for the for for the community we lost we lost that that guy you know what i'm saying and and growing up nigga i was always on the opposite side i ain't gonna cap yeah. Because I always like LeBron. Mm -hmm. LeBron was my guy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but still, T Mac was my guy. Right. And but T Mac never even got a chip. So damn, bro. I feel sorry. I mean, for I liked him. I ain't like the Magic. Speaking I of like T Mac, what do you feel about him saying? Um, Kobe said he wanted to die young. I heard that. Uh, I don't know how much truth to that is. But if that's what is, really how what he you felt, what you mean? True, what he said that. 
I mean, he said that's what he said. That's he say, she say. You know what I'm saying? Because okay. we never heard Kobe say that. So you think life. your favorite player is making it up? I don't think he's making it up. I just, that's a hell of a statement to say, bro. At that at that time you know what I'm saying? well. Exactly. I think that's just kind of. So is that thumbs down for your player? Sorry, T-Man. <laughs> <laughs> you my dog, but goddamn, bro. You picked a hell of a time to say that shit, bro. <laughs> Damn, everybody morning and shit, you like, man, he wanted that, yo. Like, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> right, like, bro. That's fucked up, bro. You should have kept that to yourself for a <laughs> little told her, bit. Told like, Vanessa to herself, like, look, he might have died happy. <laughs> no, I mean, you you, you got to hold that in the pocket sometime for just Take it a to the little grave. bit. Like, not even to the grave. You can say it, but say it later on. No, like, shit. Yeah, those, I, those say give it, it a year or something, bro. Right, like, you bring like, that shit up instantly T-Mac you lose <laughs> five points per game on your stats for that <laughs> oh shit so, uh, rest in peace Kobe man well yeah Kobe man you know it's Black History Month you know round of applause for Black History Month round of applause hey, Black. we're gonna start it off with Kobe we gotta talk at least about one black person well we're gonna talk about plenty black people Facts. so Frequently through <laughs> Black History Month, I'm gonna just be reminding everybody it's it's fucking Black History Month. Stay woke. You know what I'm saying? It would just stay something. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I ain't even saying that no more. It's 2020. Yeah. Fuck it. I'm if you want to be woke, I'm doing whatever the opposite of everybody's doing. I'm sleep. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can stay Deep woke. Sleep. Stay sleep. Just know it's Black History Month. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, bitch. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, Respect but like, that shit. Hey, hey, remember what we said last time? No white battle rappers can rap this month, bro. Yes. We still on that. And on battle rap, we have a marvelous story that I'm going to let baby go tell you <laughs> about. We have a marvelous oh, story man. down the line Bruh. about battle rap All for right. you guys. All right, look, look, look. All right, so we're jumping into that now. We're jumping into that right now. I think that story you. is so exclusive. <laughs> Just somehow. That, that's what's trending, too. Like, you know what I'm we were talking about what's trending. That's jab trending right now. So bro. let's, let's like, go ahead. You have the floor. Tell your story, my brother. All right, look. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it short. So if y'all know, if y'all watch Battle Rap, it's a battle rapper called Tay Rock. Uh, he battled on URL. He jabbed the face of URL. Um... He's been on a suck my dick campaign for the past couple months. Mm -hmm. Telling niggas suck his dick. Mm -hmm. Just tr being doing a lot, bro. So um, Bad Karma, T-Rex. I don't know if you know who T-Rex is, but he was part of Dot Mob or whatever. So um, T-Rex had a chain, a Dot Mob chain. Tay Rock ended up getting it. Told Rex, you ain't getting this shit back. Mm -hmm. uh, Sorry, stop fucking with Rex. A whole bunch of other shit happened. Um, fast forward to now, nigga had two chains. Uh, two chains. Nigga had two chains, cuz. Um, <laughs> what the story is, <laughs> some little niggas that had no strap mm. pressed his ass. Mm. He gave up the shit and ran home. But he got set up by a white crack. What did he? Well, time out. See, you're going too fast. I'm my going brother. too fast. I'm what, what did he give up? And and I need you to explain how do you think this occurred? Like, <laughs> all right, he gave up. He was get. He was ready to go fuck a crackhead white bitch. That, he was that's going that. to have sex with a crackhead. That's what the story woman. is. <laughs> that's what the story we is. Have, <laughs> you're still a queen. <laughs> we still got crackhead queen. queens too. <laughs> Whitney Houston. I'm joking. Look now. So, so he was going to do fellatio with the crackhead woman. Oh shit! So he was going. He was on the way to do this shit, and then um, some I don't know how many of it was, but they say it was at least two or three. They pressed this nigga for his chains. Okay. Like, give me your chains, bro. No gun, no strap. Wow. And he just. That's what this story. Is. I'm not saying this is true. I'm just saying this is what I heard. So he gave up the jewelry. Uh, these niggas get on Instagram. This happens Monday. They get on Instagram Tuesday. Go to the mall, get a diamond tested. Shit fake. They had real diamonds on. Like, test, test my so shit. So they did all that for a fake chain. All that for a fake chain. I think they did it just off the strength of because they had beef with him. Like, oh, out, so they up. don't. So so he knew it was up when he seen these niggas. I think it was one of them. He knew it was up. I think the other niggas was just there to back up type shit. Okay. But, um, one of them he had beef with for years. They've been back and forth online. They they never saw each other. Right. Personally, it was like an online thing. Mm -hmm. But, bro. Damn. Well, I need to say 
First of all, that is a hilarious story. <laughs> to get your chain taken and you're the gun bar king, that is a hell of a mixture. Bruh. So I I feel sorry for you that that happened. <laughs> but basically, just know like that's some hatred shit, man. They took the nigga chain, then you took his chain and it was fake. So that's some crazy. What's shit. crazy? It was worse. They broke it. On live, but they on Instagram live. He was like, man, one of them that was talking to the other one who had the chain, like, yeah. bro, I break that shit. He just uh. snapped that bit and then put it on like we got. It was said cave gang. He broke oh. the cave part off and just wore gang. He's like, we gang now, gang. Well, gang better motherfucking get that ass. Somebody better, bro, you know what I'm saying? They got their faces all. They was back and forth with Tay Rock, like, bro, come see us. Like, wow. They got their faces out there. They don't care. They all in the same city, Baltimore. So. That is wicked. Wicked, bro. <laughs> hey, stay now, strapped. <laughs> you gotta stay strapped, man. That's on God. Thanks. So, look. Um, also, you know, we personally don't give a fuck about... But, I'm not going all the way say that. But we don't care a lot about Taylor Swift. But I was right. just checking it out. And she's like, she's like the white Beyonce, nigga. Like... How? Cause she sells records and she got hella bread. That's how. What you mean? We can look it up right now. Her look net worth. It, I, bro, what the, else do we have to look up to? Oh no, we learned that because it is what it is. We're gonna say pause, but the gay culture is so big, <laughs> nigga. He, he, <laughs> this is why we're gonna explain why this all came up. It started off with Tank. This is that like mm. that's that's crazy once you mention tank mm -hmm. it veers off into some gay shit facts okay cuz I'm <laughs> talking about Gerante the yeah. champion I'm like yo you know something happened you know he touched his girl yeah in public which it. you should never ever and bro champ don't ever do that shit again bro Bruh. because that it's the me to era Facts. That is, you can't do that. Facts. You feel me? And, it's, and it, the way it looked, bro, it happens behind closed doors. And that's the part that is like now you have let this secret, a terrible secret, mm -hmm. out to the media and the public eye. And you fucked up. Facts. You nigga, swallow your pride, buy or something, and apologize Facts. in public and make it look very good. Facts. As soon as you can. <laughs> like, <laughs> as soon as you can. Facts, Please take this advice, champ. <laughs> like, Please. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> do what you got to do because I ain't going to cancel you because I know how we do. Just like with the Colin Kaepernick shit. No, I ain't canceling, champ. Nigga, just don't ever in life touch another female again, nigga. Facts. Like, I know, you know what I'm saying? I don't know y'all's situation. But I know I seen that video. Facts. And that shit look like that's enough. Yeah, don't do it, man. <laughs> that's enough, bro. Mm -mm. I know females can push them buttons, bro. But keep your hands to yourself, dog. Definitely. Cause Wait till you get in the car. <laughs> <laughs> Please. <laughs> Gonna beat her ass for goddamn right. people know like bitch what now nah, I know I beat your ass stupid. right I'm it's, playing stop <laughs> no your dead ass not to, like, I am dead look, ass. it's like you can't do that bro like you got like okay. cause it's like you gotta thank you the champ bro now that shit is always gonna come up for a little right. while. Yeah. For a little while, like that. But the shit, internet like, never go away. Yes, like you just did it on, like nigga. That was the biggest mistake ever, bro. Like, bro. at least you young, and after a couple years, it's it somebody, might die. Yeah, it gets up under the rug. I mean, yeah. look at Ray Rice. You know what I'm saying it took him some some years. Tell about what happened with Ray Rice. When he drove the bitch out the elevator. <laughs> You don't remember that? <laughs> nah, he, he, that's never going to get forgotten about. <laughs> I'm saying, but it's not like... Now he got canceled. See, that's, <laughs> see, did, that, that's what I'm saying. Then they like cancel, cancel Javante. It's like, all right, he, he yoked her up a little bit. Yeah. But that's not... <laughs> he ain't crossed the line. Like, he... He stood on that motherfucker. Yeah. But he ain't. <clears throat> no, yeah, he, ain't, he, he ain't. did not cross the gun line, boss. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> he did not cross the gun line. Yeah. He definitely. And he, he played you know with I'm it, saying? though. Like, but he ain't crossed that motherfucker. So Ray Rice crossed it and he got canceled. Nigga, he like, crossed the he, fuck out that He motherfucking Javante'd his wife. <laughs> that's, 
he took like <laughs> now that, <laughs> that that was like real talk. Bro, that's real like, shit. Though. So no, like do not ever like never like that's not cool that's at not all. Cool, like bro. no matter what, don't ever do that. So like I said, like they said, Jay Z showed what you do in an elevator Fact. with a woman if it goes down. You just gotta take the L. You just gotta take, take the L, L bro. bro. Like it's not gonna hurt, bro. If it like I mean, it'll hurt for that moment, nigga. But right. it'll be over. If she know what she doing, it might hurt for a little bit. For sure, for sure. So yeah, man, she getting crazy out here, Richmond, Virginia, man. You know the vibes, but goddamn, a three year old was shot. Right. Yeah, you know I'm saying around Hillside. You know what I'm saying, and it's like that's sad, man. Y'all gotta do better with your aim. You know what I'm saying? If you're shooting at somebody, there's no way the target was the three year old. So it's just some young niggas not knowing what they're doing. And that's not cool. That's not cool. Yeah, you know I'm saying. So just know, if that's what you want to do, you gotta do it the right way. You feel me? But yeah. don't ever, you know, you should never do that. The worst case scenario, just walk up. Right. That's the best case no, scenario. Sorry. Don't do no like y'all don't know what y'all doing. Like it's not <laughs> funny. It's Real like shit. y'all gotta know what you're doing, bro. Like that's not cool. Like that's stupid. You just like come on, man. Just imagine that could have been your kid. Fact. You just murked your three year old. You obviously didn't hit your target. They're free, and you murked a three year old. And it's like, mm, you gotta live with that. Come on, bro. I couldn't live with that shit, bro. Three year old. Uh, uh. Nah, he's gonna get haunted. Black Mamba. You know, we ain't standing for that shit. Fuck I wanted that to, shit. Yeah, I wanted to say Black Mamba haunted him, but nah, I ain't gonna even say that. <laughs> <laughs> but no, like no, nah, bro, that's so crazy. That's shit, crazy, bro. bro. We can't have that shit going down like that. Killing bro. niggas out here, killing three year olds, bro. Like that's some fucked up, corny shit, bro. So yeah. Anyways, you know, we gonna talk about Kanye West. <laughs> Kim K as well, because that ties in. You know, we looked up that Kim Kardashian is the most searched female. Now you ever. Right now, she's the most popping female in the world. Like, like not just America, in the fucking world. In the world, bro. I believe it. In and the world, Craig. Seen the numbers, yeah. <laughs> in the world, in Craig. The motherfucking world. <laughs> like, look. So look, basically, all right. So, long story short, I'm gonna let you talk about Kanye because you did somewhat go to church, right? Growing I up, still go to yeah. Uh, I grew up in church, basically. All right. So I want you to go in more on this because <laughs> it's right. like. You know, I'll give you my views, but it's like shit. I, I feel like he keeping it player. Like that's all the way. I ain't hating, bro. You oh no, no. Like, you you know, charge like, if niggas really paying you to get in the church, bro. Okay, so he's charging Kanye West fifty dollars. Okay, so how do you feel? Would you would ad- would you attend? I would go. I would go once to see. I mean, I want to see what it's about. No. If, if niggas really paying to go, bro, would you, would you still put in money in the um, collection? Fuck plate too? no, bro. <laughs> God took my blessing at the door. <laughs> what you mean, <laughs> nigga? Fifty dollars to come in this bitch? Mm. It's a pool, nigga. It's a pool, some good good. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. <laughs> so you now, so so that. What's your views on that, though? Depending on what he's, I want to see what he's talking about. Because if he really trying to get so niggas, is he preaching or is it a musical show? I thought this was a, a musical show, and know. I'm pretty sure he has a selected preacher. But uh, they say he be preaching. That's cow. If, if I, I this don't is know, true, bro. If, I don't know, bro. If, if he, this is true, and we need to find out how many people this church seats. Facts. Kanye, I feel like Kanye, Kanye would church. be. At like the Coliseum, <laughs> you right. feel me? Like Madison that's, Square Garden or some shit, bro. Like, uh you might be capping, but he could do though. He could, he could though. but like if it's just his joint on a regular, even though timeout, he did have a shit in. Um, where is he at? Where does the, the man record at? Uh, I know you talking about uh, Nebraska. Is it Nebraska? It's not Nebraska. We have to find that out right now because we can't be wrong. Bay, Bayfront Park. So bear with us because we're looking up stuff to teach y'all. <laughs> Fact. Yeah, you know I'm saying Kanye Can't teach West y'all the wrong shit. records. I think it's Montana, bro. I ain't even have to look at it. Look it up. I believe he records in in Montana, bro. Or in my booth. Kanye West brings Sunday service to downtown Miami. I don't even know, bro. I'm looking at it right fact now. Fact check that shit. 
I'm looking at it right now. But Sunday service is fifty bucks, and if you want to go, have that bread. Have that bread. Fly there, get your room. So it's gonna be a lot more than fifty. Facts. It's a motherfucking show. This and I look, think, bro, this is I think y'all need the blessing, man. Yeezus should charge a hundred fifty. Look how big this shit is. God damn. Niggas, this shit look dope though. <laughs> this nigga, it, it, all his church services are outside. Nigga, oh, Kanye is the motherfucking man. Also, so is Kim Kardashian. Bro, he he been the, the man. He, he been making niggas back clothes with holes in them for years, bro. He been the man. He started like fashion. He's the fashion god, fashion guru. Nigga, he fucked up too. With the slavery is a choice. He fucked. This is he why, like they said, that's why he straight went. That's why. That's probably why Sunday service got created. He was like, man, I fucked up. So Javante, you gonna have to probably do that. Yeah. You fucked up. Just go to church a couple times. <laughs> yeah. Take some pictures. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Put that money in the collection plate. Facts. And we gonna forgive you. You know what I'm saying? We gonna forgive you. So definitely go to church now, my brother. Facts. Now. So four percent of women, I would look this up. Okay, think they're beautiful. Just four. That's what it said, but it makes sense when I thought about it. Like that sounds dumb, but what are your thoughts from that standpoint? I see that like, those statistics. Women are very insecure. A lot of women are insecure. Right. So I um, I can see that. Right, and it makes sense because now think about it. Like it's damn near like. It's normal now to get work done. So that right. that is a hundred percent obvious that yeah. you're insecure. Mm -hmm. You pay to look like something different. Fact. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like so that's that's one. They be doing a lot, you know, no disrespect, Queens, but I'm pulling cars. They pull our cars. Y'all want to try to get at Javante? I'm uh -huh. fighting. Yeah. But I'll take the L because you cannot fuck with them. <laughs> you can't fuck with them. Straight up. I'll take Facts. the L. Y'all got it. Fuck it. It's over. I got it. So, you know, you got the fake everything, nigga. Mm -hmm. Eyelashes. <laughs> Weave. Nails. Keep going. Titties. Keep going. Ass. The filters. Filters. Angles. Mm. Photoshop. Mm. You like, bruh. The waist trainer. Like, the little waist shit that be trying to yes. shrink their stomach and shit, bro. Yes. Like, mm. like bro, think about it. We don't do... We just get a haircut. Facts. Nah, some niggas take dick pills. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to you, niggas. <laughs> Shout out to y'all niggas. <laughs> dick pills is funny. <laughs> They either get that machine to, to pump they shit or they get them pills, bro. Like, yo, you have to treasure your shit. <laughs> or some niggas, they, they get that Rogaine because they, they go bald. All right, that's that's another thing I wanted to talk about because I was talking to a lovely queen. Mm -hmm. And we were talking about basically, like, men is now getting surgery. You feel me? Think about that's it. That's a fact. Fake teeth, fake hairline. Facts. They're getting fake abs. That's a fact. Like, that's crazy. So now too, we're bro. moving forward to the future. <laughs> and it's like now the niggas is doing bitch shit. Yeah. Because straight up, that's some bitch shit. They but, trying to look good for the bitches. Bro, that's OD though. Like, fuck it, bro. I mean, but it might be some niggas don't want to be bald. Some niggas want to be. But I mean. I mean, some shit I can't. I'm not going to understand. The what ball joint is straight though. Because Tory Lanez, he wore it. Tiger too, Tiger. That nigga got braids, braids. Tiger, man, bro, like, yeah, he do. That nigga hair, he got hair. <laughs> hey, it's the one John that I think he messed with. I don't know. I think her name is Kennedy Simone. Now I don't know if it's he true. I think so. You know who that is? Yeah, nigga, I think so. And she's fire. Facts. Shout out to whoever. Cheers, like, like, shout Cheers out to her. Tiger. <laughs> Tiger, <laughs> yo, he might got like when it come to taste. That nigga, like, that's why that song was so fire. Yeah, pedophile. Though. No, he's not, because he it was, was legal. With, bro, she was. I'm talking about. She uh, was 17. Kylie Jenner, right? She was 17. That's not and legal. Le it was that's legal in California. Bro, that's weird in a man for a man. He, that nigga I, was 20. Bro, no. He was 20, bro. I'm not downing my nigga for messing with a fucking future billionaire. No.
I'm, and he was still uh, in his 20s. Uh, you right. You got to think, right. at the time, you Tiger right. might have been like 26. Because it was like, damn, that is weird. Yeah. But after you see the, the fucking, the whole situation transpire, the motherfucking... The caterpillar turn into the butterfly. Yeah, like it was like, yo, fuck that. He's a genius. I'm not. I'm but, he not ain't, but he ain't got no kids with it though. It don't matter. He he's hitting the Ray J. I hit it first. Fast. Yeah, you know I'm saying he's hitting that Ray J. Yeah. Then he had Black China. Don't matter. That's yeah. good taste. She rich as fuck. She be yeah. driving Ferraris. She been ran through though. Okay. It don't matter. Yeah. Niggas run through janks every day. Why is it see double standards? I feel you. I feel you. I see where you going from. Like she you. getting ran through and getting her bag ran up. Tay Rock Rex. running through a crackhead. Why can't Bruh. Black China? <laughs> why can't Black China get ran through for the bag? <laughs> like, <laughs> hey, sorry, Tay Rock. <laughs> you was my nigga, but you looking shaky out here, bro. Bro, oh my God. Now, yes, if you now, all right. So if your chain got took and you want to choose yo, you wanna you wanna keep your motherfucking face card. You have to be the one to black the whites, block the whites from battle rap, nigga. Mm. Yeah, nigga. You gotta be that. If nigga. you do that, fuck that chain, nigga. I don't give a fuck about that chain. Facts. Care that shit like certain shit do happen at certain times. You just gotta be ready. He got caught slipping. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you can get caught slipping and get smoked. You know what I'm saying? Right. So fuck that chain. Yeah, like fuck that shit, you know bro. what I'm saying? But but this dead ass, like, nigga, I'm going to say you a bitch. If, if niggas take your chain and you let a white nigga battle rap in Black History Month after a white dude said nigga, no. He just battled a white dude, too. That's crazy. Hey, yeah. don't ever battle another white dude either. Straight up. <laughs> Straight up. He's supposed to be battling a white dude next month. Bro. Oh, my God, bro. Chill out, bro. It's next month, though. It's not Black History Month. All right, all right. If it ain't Black History Month, get your money, nigga. Get your money. So, Antonio Brown... He's apologizing now. You know what I'm saying? (laughs) Salute to the black man, though, man. Because it get me kind of tight, you know, how they railroaded my mans. But it's like he might have just been going through shit. But I do want to say sometimes niggas do forget. Yeah. Why they even playing the game? Like Facts. sometimes this shit ain't even about the bread and all that. Like nigga, yeah. you just you still you probably played football because you was that nigga, nigga, and you loved it. Yeah. But you know, anyways, you got anything to say? You know what's on your mind, nigga? Shit, that new guy is a drop. I love how that he did that because fire. nigga, I was just thinking like, oh, we about to bring up the music because it was a wonderful weekend Bruh, for music. It was. So go ahead, talk about the guy. That guy, that shit is fire, bro. I've been waiting for guy to drop something that just get me that old guy that feel, bro. I was, I was into that shit nonstop, bro. And that two minute features, he really rapping on that shit, talking that shit, nigga. Like, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Gotti. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for real. We appreciate Thank that. Thank you, Gotti. And, and Gotti's a good person to keep bigging up. You Facts. know what I'm saying? Because it's like he got them open the doors for Memphis. I don't know what him and Yo Gotti, I mean, him and Young Dolph got going on. That's that's weird. Yeah, something else. But, <laughs> but as far as what he's doing, that nigga moved like the motherfucking president. And he got, bro, you know, him and uh, 36 used to beat back in the day. He got a little chat on his own. He got what? Lil Chat. You remember Lil Chat from Three Six Mafia? Yeah. She on she on the Untrapped album. Oh, for real. And then DJ Paul shouted Gotti out like, "Yo, shout out to Gotti for reaching out." Type shit like. I seen he got Uzi and Megan Megan Thee Stallion on the same song. That's gonna sell. Now that, that's the selling song. Like that's the sell song. But yeah, the other shit is the horror shit. Nah, but that don't. <laughs> I fuck with that. Like, but it sounds super, super pop commercial. Like that song. Pose. Yeah, Pose. yeah. That Pose. song. <laughs> like, I want to see what happens with that one. Yeah. Like, I want to see because they got the video and everything. But like, besides that, you know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, besides that song, bro. But the rest but of that go. I I just feel like that John was just super commercial. I mean, but. he got it always make at least one commercial commercial song. Yeah, because he did the single and, jump, and it, fast eye bitch. Uh, he makes the them song songs just to sell. Down in DM is crazy though. But I don't think that was supposed to be 
this thing. I think he was just making a song. Yeah, I think he was just dead ass. And then he was like, like fuck it, I, I like this shit. Like, he probably was scoring like a motherfucker in a deal, man. He probably that, just that feeling Because he really started the whole way with that shit, bro. Because yeah. niggas won't say in, they won't say Niggas won't own that shit. Niggas <laughs> won't admit it yet. He like, Not niggas, at all, niggas, bro. Niggas been in the DMs. <laughs> Facts. Like, uh, forever, like. And he shot his shot with Angela Simmons. Like, on Facts. the song, my Facts. nigga. Like. And it's sad with her because I think her man died. Got murdered. Her baby daddy. Yeah. Was it about? Like, I don't know who it was. I don't know. We're going to look. Uh, Rest in peace to his family. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, free the homies, too. Like, free them. I got plenty of homies. Like, they locked now. That's crazy. Bring man. them home. Free bro. all the homies. So, yeah. Um, the best days in life are free. Little Wayne drop. I'm not here for that. Please, bro, don't do that. Explain yourself. All right. Explain yourself. Let me tell you what. I like mixtape Wayne, but when it comes to albums, Wayne don't give me nothing. Like that. I Everything that's happened to Wayne in the past five years could have been an album. He could have talked about Birdman taking his money, about mm -hmm. Dakota Fab being on hold, him almost died over the seizures. There's a lot. Kobe Bryant, nigga. Like, he could have talked about a lot of different. He couldn't have talked about Kobe I'm Bryant. I'm saying, yet. I mean, he he had a, he had a song called, or he had a song number eight. It was like 24 second pause for Kobe Bryant. So he threw in something for Kobe. I'm, I'm just saying, like he probably just threw that in. Like, I, I, I know. That, I'm just saying, but it's a lot of shit that happened to him personally true. that he could have touched on. I'm gonna say I agree, but what if that's in the vault? Like that don't mean you have to give it to a nigga when he want it. Pause. Like I mean, but. We've grown with Wayne since Wayne was 16. He ain't gave us that song, that CD since the college. I personally think about it like, think at it like, okay, you got to just appreciate Wayne. You feel me? Because like, like Wayne is like, they like I watched this interview and they said, nigga, he got the children. Like, niggas do look like fucking Wayne. Facts. We got so many fucking other rappers because of Wayne. That's a fact. Yeah, you know I'm saying? So it's just like, Nah, like when he dropped, I got eyes. I mean, I, listen, I always listen. And you know he got I mean? a record on there with Big Sean and and he, and, uh, and and Lil, Lil Baby. Baby. Now guess what? I, I yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he got songs on there. Fuck. Yeah, he got some bars on there. He got yeah, some Wayne, Wayne he got bars, bars, bro. Wait, he got bars. I ain't gonna but never do that. No, 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 no. I see what you're saying though. Yeah. You want some more mature Wayne? Like, all right. So can I give someone credit? Like Ross. How Ross be rapping on his albums? I like Ross. I, I ain't gonna hold you. I did not like Ross back in the day, bro. But Ross grew on me. Okay. I think deep in the rap, at the deep in the rap, I'm like, I right, he, he talking a little. He talk I was I was so after like goddamn Big Meat. Like from that moment on, is yeah. when he like was on fire. I was so <laughs> yeah. like straight up Ross that nigga. That shit like I knew who he was before since hustling. Yeah. But when Big Meat dropped. I was a fan, like you think I'm big <laughs> yeah. I'm like, oh, I got to see him perform and everything out here at yeah. the motherfucking um way back, whatever they call that shit that be downtown at Browns Island. I don't know what the fuck. Yeah, I don't Stone Soul. Yeah, okay. Yeah, man, I'm fucking seen Ross at Stone Soul. And he put niggas on. He put Meek Mill on. Put Wale on. Put that part. Gunplay that part. on. Staley. It's a lot of niggas, yeah, bro. So, like, yeah. So man, look, I feel like you know we gonna wrap it up soon because we could talk forever. You know what I'm saying? And that's just to let you know we getting blessed up. You know what I'm saying? The audio. We're going to end off with audio. Talking about audio. We, you know what I'm saying? we. It was kind of muffled. A little bit. I seen someone even write a comment. What they say, bro? He said, yo, y'all got to fix the audio. Mm. I was like, all right, nigga. <laughs> 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 I, know, I ain't know how. But, but, we was going to get it done, though, Your buddy. message got received, Facts, nigga. So nigga. Definitely. <laughs> Shout out to you, Shout nigga. Shout out to you, nigga. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah, man, we definitely gonna wrap this up. You already know, man. We just dropped some. Well, we ain't didn't drop it yet. We got hella interviews on the way for these mm, niggas. Talk that you shit. You know what I'm saying? We got hella scam casts coming. Swipe. Hella money coming in. Hella singles coming. Swipe. Projects coming. Ooh, talk that Everything. shit. Everything. Shout out DJ Melly Mel and shout out. Bitch. More money coming. Yeah. More shout out my nigga versus. Oh, Humble shit. hustler. You know what I'm saying? You already know the Brands. vibes, nigga. Straight yeah. up, man. Straight like Stay that. black. You already know, man. Scam guy. It's baby goat. Hey. Nigga. E Sweet. Cop a lot of chains and a lot of rings.
Mauro.